Hey guys, Henning from Flip Normals here and welcome to Introduction to Sculpting. In this exclusive Flip Normals tutorial, we are going to be teaching you everything you need to know about sculpting. We spent the last 15 years sculpting and in this series, we are breaking down all the knowledge we have into easy and digestible chunks, which will really improve your sculpting. While we are using ZBrush, this is a software agnostic tutorial, so for the vast majority you can follow along in any sculpting software you prefer. It doesn't even matter if you're using CG for this, you could be sculpting in wood, traditional wood, you could be sculpting using stone, you could be using this for figure drawing. What we are talking about in this series is a combination of techniques and ways of thinking which will dramatically improve all your sculpts whether you're doing stylized or realistic it's a good mix between theoretical techniques and very practical sculpting where the first part is focusing on sculpting fundamentals this is where we are going through how to do certain things how to block out the base meshes how to get started with the projects and also why you are doing what you're doing. Focus on getting good, clean shapes, stylized sculpting. What's the difference between low, high and uh, mid frequency? We're also focusing heavily on uh, other concepts such as how do you use reference when sculpting? What brushes do you actually use? People tend to overcomplicate the tools themselves significantly. So really just covering the few tools you need in order to do really anything. We're also talking about what is the difference between basics and fundamentals, which is absolutely essential to know before you're really getting into sculpting. And there's also a huge topic as well, which is on appeal. Appeal is one of these incredibly hard topics to really define what is appeal. It's one of these things where if you look at the model which has appeal, you're just instantly going to recognize it. But if you look at one without appeal, it's very hard to say what's missing. And we are really trying to deconstruct that concept. If you know how to make an appealing sculpt, everything is going to be so much easier. And we're spending a lot of time really conveying what that actually means. We're also teaching you how to make really nice high frequency details as well using a provided alpha from the Fripinal Skin Kit, which you can use to really make nice pores and really just make your skin feel realistic. And we're also talk, of course talking about when you should use it and when you should not use these high frequency techniques. In the second part of the tutorial, we are showing you a very practical demonstration of how to make a really appealing dwarf from scratch in ZBrush. This is around a five hour tutorial and it goes start to finish from a sphere, blocking it out more, refining the shapes to really making the final sculpture. Everything is real time where all the steps are covered step by step. So all in all, this is an incredibly elaborate tutorial series spanning almost 15 hours where you'll learn everything you really need in order to get started with sculpting. So thank you so much for checking out Introduction to Sculpting. We put a lot of love and effort into this series and we really sincerely hope that this improves your sculpting. So thank you so much.